top three skills that someone needs to thrive in the future? Um, so I, I, I think the main one is, is empathy. That the, again, something that can be done by a single individual uh, across a single set of rules, a computer is much better, uh, much better set up to do that than a person. And so what I think what we're going to begin to see is the person who, one, can deal well with ambiguity, and then two, can work well with others. Because again, those are the things that cannot be supplanted by a computer system. One of the, one of the interesting things that we look at very closely is what's called the substitution effect. And this is that you, if you have two people, you have, you, have, you have Harlan and you have Dan. And Dan's really good, Dan's a really good chef, and Dan's a really good brain surgeon. What's going to happen is Dan's going to go to the to the job that has the most compensation. Dan's going to be the brain surgeon. That means I get to be the chef. Even if Dan is good at both and better at both than me, there's still space for me. What happens with a lot of these automation technologies is not only is it good at everything, it's infinitely scalable. So it can take both jobs. It no longer needs me. So what we need to see to what Need to begin to pivot towards is what are those roles that people are uniquely good at? And again, the main thing people are really good at, most people, not all people, I have an older brother, <laughs> is working well with others. And I think that's going to be one of the dominating factors is those people who can, who can work well with the team, who can motivate a team, who can keep a team pointed in the right direction, that's going to be one of the dominating skills that you'll see for success. I think being a proactive learner, not because someone pushed you, but you're proactive about constantly learning. But those people just lie to the future. Yeah, that's great. Um, any other skills that um, I think communications, communication is going to be absolutely key. Because the other thing that we're beginning to see, where the biggest opportunity is for businesses now, is the integration of products, is the integration of services, is the integration of technologies. And what we've historically seen is that you have silos. You have a particular industry or you have a particular discipline or you have a particular technology that is completely self-contained. And the people who work in that technology, they have their own vocabulary, they have their own assumptions, their own principles, and they have their own measure of what success looks like. Where the, the biggest opportunities for new business is gonna be is in the seams between those, is in the integration of products and services. That, especially as we, we, I've seen this not just at Google, but at small companies, as you try to bring those groups together, you get a lot of conflict, you get a lot of tension. People don't understand each other. People are explaining things in ways that each other can't understand. They're measuring success in different ways. To take advantage of that integration of those products, services, technology, and, industries, you've got to have those people who understand how to communicate, how to make themselves clear, how to be able to bring that team and that product across the finish line. I think you also have to deal with, especially at Google, the blending of cultures yes. and being able to communicate cross culture. Yeah, it's, uh, it, it's really amazing how, how microcultures are so different and they create a tremendous amount of tension between teams. And when you have a 100,000 person company, there are literally a thousand different cultures out there. And it will be that person, that software engineer, that product manager, that analyst, who's able to cut across and able to meet the other team that way, able to communicate, able to get some consensus and get everybody moving in the same direction. That, those are the people that the success of that team and that product 